Hey, welcome to Base Camp. This is Josh, his truck, and his grill. And I'm Matt. Together, Josh and I have set up a few goals to show Michigan as a state able to support a split board community. So we start in the end of January where parts of the Upper Peninsula are showing snow depths up to two feet. We took a few days off from work, decided to stay in Mass City, and then made a game plan from there. Lonan Hill is off of Highway 26 south of Tri Mountain. Today we decided to boot pack our way to the top because the path towards the radio tower was already plowed. Here we are at the drop in of Talonan Hill. We decided to drop northeast down the hill towards the road that we hiked up. Here's our run. Ooh. Yeah. Oh man, I got a nice heel side turn into my face. Alright, dropping. I'd recommend this area to most riders. It's a great place to get fresh tracks and build a jump and has easy access in and out. We only hiked to the top once, but did unstrap to hike up two different ridges. Next stop was in Houghton, Michigan. This was just an unexpected pow field off the highway, so we had to stop. And the best part is, Josh just had to drop me off at the top and pick me up at the bottom. Next, we went to the Porcupine Mountain Ski Resort. I've never been to it before, so the plan is to ride half a day and then split board the second half. When we arrived, Josh was asking around about an old cat skiing operation near the Porkies. 
Yeah. yeah. It doesn't have to be gnarly kill yourself shit, man. Right. Some... Gnarly kill yourself, take one. Go. <laughs> <laughs> we'll keep your distance. Hold yeah, on. Yeah, watch this guy. He's about to shot. fall on this shit. Gnarly kill yourself. Take one. My backpack's gonna get stuck out of shit. Oh, you can't turn sideways. Not like on a snowboard. Yo, dude, oh, you gotta, shit. <laughs> you gotta be straight, you gotta bro. figure this out. Oh, okay. Yeah. Did it. Got it. In stride. Whoa. That's not an easy hill, people. All right, so now, here you're gonna head off the chair and go down here to the tow rope. Follow this guy. Never done tow rope on skis. With skins. We did it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Not too bad. Got the radio tower. That was the main part of the objective, but we don't know what to expect. If we gotta turn around, it's too thick, not enough snow. But let's go see what's up here. If you look up at the top of the mountain, to your west is a radio tower. And with an old picture of the Everest Glades, we set out towards this radio tower, thinking it was near and our best shot of finding some powder. Shoot, we might find something so good while we here tomorrow. I'm going right a little bit and left, kind of. What are you thinking? Okay. Oh, 
Yeah, that's sick. Yeah. Yeah. Here it is. Woo. 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 What? Yeah, the best part about split order. Wow, the porkies was sweet. I'll be watching yeah. for another snowstorm to make it back soon. So we call this split mission Slaying the Dragon because of the task we knew ahead. By the looks of it, there were a few options to reach in the summit of Mount Houghton. So we set out at 1230 at the Fisheries Road, knowing that a three mile skin could reach the summit by 3 p.m., which will give us enough time to make it back to the truck by sunset. Hey Josh. Sweet. Looking at it. That direction. Come on, man. Use them skiing skills. <laughs> no? So that was a bust. Uh, we were all excited, saw the trail. We're heading Mount Houghton. Wrong trail. So we gotta go back. We already bushwhacked in like you know, 500 feet maybe. But uh, we're back trail. Get on the main trail again, the Fisheries Road, and hope to find a left turn. And it's a trail that'll take us kind of the east side of Mount Houghton. We wanted to come on from the face, but just no clear cut trails take you that way. So go with what makes sense. Oh yeah, I got downhill. Nice. Always fun going downhill. Just came down the fisheries road and here's our left turn to Houghton. It's wide open. You can't miss it. Don't go any two bushwhacking, two tracking. <laughs> it's from the peak to the creek. 
so. Here to here. So, which way do you think is that loop? This is the loop. This is the loop here. Going away from the mountain. Here's Mount Houghton. Here's the loop going away. This is us. This is this trail. If we follow that, we'd have to connect. We're going about a mile in. What? Okay. There is our best look at Mount Houghton. Unfortunately, we took too many wrong trails that we decided it's too late to summit the mountain. Then we decided not to follow our tracks back because we felt it was about the same distance back to the truck. So we took a new trail to scout the area. What a mistake. As the cold and dark settled in, our phones had died and we couldn't find any tracks to follow out. I had a good idea of where to go, but when hunger settled in and a fear of possibly not being correct, I knew this trip could get real bad real quick. 10 miles from the start of the day, finally, we found the road back to the truck where we were able to catch a ride by a local driving by. Country claim freedom but lead incarceration. 